Okay, now consider the question number 38 of this J event 2015 maths paper code D. Limit x approaching to 0, 1 minus cos 2x multiplied with 3 plus cos x divided with x tan 4x is equal to. A simple question from limit part, we can get the result as limit x approaching to 0. 1 minus cos 2x can be written as 2 sin square x, correct? 3 plus cos x on applying limit x approaching to 0, it is not creating any trouble, so no need to disturb it. 1 minus cos 2x was going to become 0, we changed it, this is also going to be 0, we will plan about it. Sin square x needs x square in denominator. So, let us multiply with the same term, right? x into tan 4x, it needs 4x in denominator. So, multiply and divide by the same term. Now, we observe this will go to 1 when x is approaching to 0. This will approach to 1 when x is approaching to 0. This will become 3 plus 1 that is 4 x square cancelled out like this, right? This 4 and 4 cancelled out. Simply, we are left with the answer 2 that is option 1 is correct. So, correct answer is first option. That is clear. Let us go for the next question that is 39th. The distance of the point 1 comma 0 comma 2 from the point of intersection of the line x minus 2 upon 3 equals y plus 1 upon 4 equals z minus 2 upon 12 and the plane x minus y plus z equals 16. So, distance of a given point from the point of intersection of the line and plane. So, we can start it by assuming let there be a point on the line say p, we can consider this term as lambda, right? When we take it as lambda, we get 3 lambda plus 2, 4 lambda minus 1, 12 lambda plus 2 as a general point on this line. We are talking about intersection of line and plane. Put this point on this plane. We get 3 lambda plus 2 minus 4 lambda minus 1 plus 12 lambda plus 2 is equal to 16. On simplifying, this is 15 minus 4 that is 11 lambda equals 3 plus 2, 5 and here 16 giving me 11 or lambda becomes 1. Put this lambda back in point P. We get point P here as 5 comma 3 comma 14. Now, the question is simply about finding distance of this point P 5, 3, 14 from the point 1, 0, 2. Apply distance formula. Therefore, distance equals root of 16 plus 9 plus 144 that is 13. So, from the given options, option number 2 is correct. So, this is clear. Let us go for the next question.